TFNN Headline News Update Here's Tom O'Brien Welcome folks, we had the Dow Industrials finish up uh, 327 We had the Nasdaq up 99, S&P's up 33 That's a gain for, at 1% for the S&P's folks 1.3% for the Nasdaq and 1.2% for the Dow Industrials. Gold contract, gold contract down $6.40, trading at $12.92 an ounce. Silver down uh, 4 cents, $15.07 an ounce. Both gold and silver are basically at the lows of Friday. We haven't broke, silver had broken the lowest swing point on Thursday, came back inside of Friday. The lowest swing point we're talking about in gold is 1287.50. Oil, oil broke topside, up a buck and a half, $61.64. Um, oil can run to 65 right now. Uh, bottom line, took about a week and a half for that to break. It was pushing on that swing point, had volume uh, as it was pushing on it. Notes and bonds, they came down today. Had the 10 year note down 26, 123.19. 30-year bond down a point and a half at 148.03. And if we get over, we take a look at that 10-year uh, first. What you're going to see, folks, uh, you're down, coming back into the breakout area. You're doing it with light volume. Bottom line is that if you have the, uh, I booked the out of time in your trade, you know, this is a normal occurrence when you break topside or break downtown. You break topside, which we did in the 10 as well as the 30th on the 22nd. The low of that is 123.10. Uh, actually, it's uh, as low as 122.23. Bottom line, you pull back today with 1.5 million contracts versus 2.5. Inside the 30-year, same type of setup inside the 30-year. Uh, bottom line, big pullback, price pullback, no doubt, point and a half. Um, that being said, 306,000 contracts uh, versus uh, you got uh, 540. Um, what you had out here today, the window dressing and spades, no two ways about that. Uh, you had the, the managers uh, going into the financials. You had the XLF of 63 cents, $26.36, as well as the transports. Tran transports hadn't got a, a bid for quite some time. Transports up 235, uh, trading at a price point of 10643 We get over and we take a look at the... King dollar, king dollar, also in its higher range. Uh, bottom line, this is going to be all about uh, what we're going to have happen with the euro. The pound still wants higher price. The euro, folks, is teetering at its low. Stay right there, folks. Going to be coming back with some numbers. To recap out here, we had the Dow Industrials finish up 329. NASDAQ up 99. S&P's up 30. Come right now.